drove in, into the game camp now to see if we can find some ostriches. We've just started uh, supplementing the ostriches uh, diet with some soybeans. It's harvest time now and it's just the start of winter also. Now soybeans contain a lot of oils, about 50%, and a lot of protein, almost 30%. And uh, we want to see if it does not affect their stomachs, the sudden uh, increase in uh, rich food in their diet. Unfortunately, it has a weakness. Its resistance to disease is very weak, especially avian uh, diseases. And uh, it places our birds in quarantine and affects our e economy because uh, uh, we can't export the meat, we can't export the products and, unless they have, uh, they have been uh, improved, unless they, uh, the skins cannot be imported, unless they have been made into, into items already. We found a few ostriches, these are all mature uh, ostriches, uh, some males and some females that these here will uh, pair off in about six months. They start to pair off and start to mate, then uh, they're going to uh, lay some eggs, between four and twelve eggs to a, a brood. It takes 35 to 45 days to hatch. The ostriches diet consists mainly of grasses and uh, seeds. It will browse a little bit, but it prefers seeds because of the high protein content. On the hyphen, we have a, a very high uh, survival rate of the, 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 the chicks hatched. And uh, once the ostriches has passed a year, they do very well. They're very resilient to both cold and heat. They're quite peculiar because they eat stones from a pea size up to a golf ball size to help them to digest uh, the seeds and the other things they, they eat. So you will see an ostrich swallow 20% stones to, with its, uh, its brows and grays and seeds. They run a lot to get rid of the e excess um, um, energy that they build up because they don't uh, store fat in their body and uh, the excess fat, uh, energy is shed by, uh, by exercise. It's a wonderful animal.